Hello, this is Kirill from forexboat.com and welcome to this tutorial on creating your own automated trading strategies for the foreign exchange market. We will be using the MetaTrader 4 trading platform and consequently our programming language is MQL4. Um, I'm assuming that you already have MetaTrader 4 installed and that um, you have Meta the meta editor window in front of you. So what we're going to do today is we're going to create a very simple uh, program which says or outputs onto your screen uh, the phrase uh, hello world. It's kind of a tradition in programming that when you start learning a new language uh, that's the first thing that you code. Alright so what we're going to do is uh, in meta editor in the top left corner we're going to click new and this will bring up uh, the MQL wizard um, it's the MQL wizard is not something that we're going to be necessarily using uh, all the time going forward but it's a very handy tool to have and to use um, especially when you're just getting started with MQL4 so right now we have a choice of uh, six different options uh, an expert advisor custom indicator script library include new class so an expert advisor is um, the ultimate um, program that we're going to be aiming to code uh, at the, by the end of this course it's uh, it's a robot it's a trading robot that actually executes orders on the foreign exchange market an indicator um, shows uh, it basically allows you to create your own indicator uh, which can give you signals and um, uh, identify certain things on the market. A script is a uh, program that gets executed once and only once as soon as it's attached to the, start, uh, to the chart and uh, about the other three we'll uh, talk some, some other time they're not as crucial at this stage. So we're going to select a script because it's the easiest of the top three um, then we're going to click next. Uh, we're going to give our script a name over here at the top after the backslash. Um, you can call it whatever you like. I'm just going to call it tutorial one. Um, as if if this is your first time using Meta Editor and you've just installed it, then these uh, two fields, author and link, will be populated with default values. I suggest you change them to uh, something that is relevant to you. So you have copyright over the uh, code and plus somebody can find you if they they ever want to get to get in touch. Um, we're not going to have any parameters at this stage so we'll just click finish. Um, so what happened here is uh, the wizard has created a uh, script for us. Uh, it's a script template. Uh, you can check that the script actually exists by clicking opening the script folder on the left and you'll see your script here, tutorial one. Um, so everything that starts with double slash is a comment. Uh, it is ignored by the compiler. So basically when you create this script into a working program, uh, all these lines will be ignored. Um, they're there just for um, visual interpretation. We're gonna get rid of this line and this line because they're basically useless. Um, these four properties, uh, they uh, describe the program to MetaTrader 4 and we're not going to focus on them because uh, they just get put there all the time by the wizard and um, uh, they're not really relevant to us at this stage. What we're going to focus on is this part. Um, this is the function or this is the body of the program which and it gets executed as soon as you attach the script to the chart. Right now, inside the body, there's there's nothing inside the body, uh, and um, that uh, when I say inside, I mean between these two curly brackets. So we want to add some code to the program. We're going to put it between these two curly brackets, and what we're going to do is we're going to type in alert, alert, uh, and you can see it's come up here as a prompt. Alert is a uh, built-in function that allows you to put output messages onto the screen. So we'll just uh, use it at this stage. We'll type in alert, then we'll put in two brackets and we'll put a semicolon. 
um, inside the two brackets we need to type in our message message has to be uh, in quotation marks so we'll put two quotation marks and between them we will say hello world exclamation mark so that's basically it alert um, and then within the brackets uh, our message in quotation marks and please don't forget the semicolon on the end um, that is quite important all right so that's our program now we're going to compile it and what that means is we're going to create an executable file we're going to click compile as you can see here the compiler says that there's zero errors and zero warnings which is good which means that everything worked fine now we're going to go to uh, MetaTrader 4 by clicking this button over here um, this is MetaTrader 4 and here we are going to um, find our script um, so on the left in the navigator panel just open up the scripts menu and uh, find tutorial 1 and now we're going to attach it to the screen and hopefully that what will happen is we'll see the message hello world so let's give it a go attach and there we go it says hello world and um, that's all we wanted to do for today um, I hope uh, it was uh, a useful tutorial and um, more tutorials and uh, information are available on forexboat.com and until the next tutorial happy coding